At the end of the day, the foundation, wherever you are asking for this kind of support is obviously with your audience. So you need people. What kind of people do you need? You need, obviously, your friends and your family, the ones you already know. They're your thousand Facebook friends, which my guess is a lot of the people in this community have a lot of friends that are already there. Then you've got whatever your niche issue area is or possibly people that you have done work with in the course of this project. And that is that outer circle. Then you've got people who care about that issue but might not have a direct connection to it that's so obvious, but they're affiliated with a like-minded institution that exists or someone else doing similar work to you. And then you've got potential organizational partners that could in some way, shape, or form be affected by the work that you're doing. These are all your potential people that could be giving to you or could be helping you build your email lists or your Facebook fans, etc. The most important thing that still, even though there is things are always evolving for the way we use technology, in 2012, email and getting email addresses is still one of the most important things you can do. A year from now, that could change, but for now, email drives the most giving and the most money, so that's why you care about it. Even if it's not the only way that you reach out to people to let them know what you're up to, you still want their email addresses, for now. So there's a lot of talk of nobody reads their emails, everyone gets too many emails. If you've got 900 people on your email list, or 5,000 people, or 50,000 people, they're probably going to be at least 20%, possibly even up to 40% of those people that are gonna open their email. And that is still a lot of people. They're more likely to give more than anyone who comes to you from another medium. And that is what you care about for this purpose. So how can you get their email addresses? Are you, were you involved in Half This Guy? We are now, as of today. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Blue State built this website. Oh. Um, and you can see that the first thing your eye jumps to is how you can give your email address. Get involved. And also the other channels of how to reach them. The actions and the asks here, and I, I, this isn't a talk about um, building a website, but it's very clear what you can do as a user. Most importantly, I can see exactly where to give my email. And that should be the number one thing every website that gets built and designed today has above the fold, no matter what. The more Facebook friends you have, the more likely you are to increase the support that you get, especially on crowdfunding sites. The donations, Facebook and Twitter aren't driving donations in a way that email is quite yet in terms of direct contributions. However, there's some statistics that they can drive increased funding on crowdfunding sites. So you can use a lot of different touch points to drive as, mo as much money as you can to you. And this is a really important one. And if you know you're gearing up for a campaign, do you ha have you friended everyone you could possibly friend? Because it's going to matter, especially if you're really, really determined to raise money.